Hello, good people. I don't even know where to start right now. I've started to look up some words like Judah, Ju Jerusalem, and Zebulun because I wanted to know what they meant in Hebrew. Judah means God's kingdom. Jerusalem means the foundation of peace. And Zebulun means the dwelling place of honor, which is our temple, which is our hearts. Um, so that brought me to a place where I started to look up all the names of the Lord. And um, some of them range from the Lord of glory, Lord of all, uh, leader and commander, messenger of the covenant, morning star, bread of life, our Passover, Prince of Life, Prince of Peace, Prophet, all these, and I found scriptures that related to it. Now I'm going to do a whole different video for all of that and list quite a few of them, um, but I want to highlight what the Lord brought me to, and I'm going to read it. So I wanted to know what begotten meant, and um, I found that begotten means offspring, kindred, kindred of, and birth, um, to become, to bear, to bring forth, and to deliver, descended. So I looked up some scripture and I found this, human power exalted by the descension of Jesus unto man, begotten by the Father as a labor of love, produced and begotten to save all man from their wicked ways through God's Son, the principal helper, which is the Prince of Peace, perfect and pure to bear all sin of man, declaring that all belong to God and are delivered of God through his begotten Son. Our names written in the book of life and God's name written in each man and woman, declaring we are his own. I'm blown away. I, I'm getting goosebumps. I got all of that from looking up begotten in the Hebrew and Greek translation. Um, it's on the HebrewStrongBibleHub.com. Um, it's hard to find. Uh, I go to DuckDuckGo to find it. I hope this helps. God bless and just amazing our Lord is. We are written in his heart, he in our hearts. Amen. Thank you, Jesus.